Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I am Dark Xena Knight, and this is a Minecraft Monday. Now, if you look down here, as you can see, I worked very hard on putting auto smeltery together. Well, it's a whole system. I have all the berry bushes going automatically into here. Uh, the reason why is if you come upstairs and look at my uh, AE system, you can see I have a little bit of a problem here with drives being full of equipment. I stayed logged in one day for the spawner and ended up with a bunch of garbage I didn't need. So if I look through here, I have a ton of this armor, which is just unbelievable. I'm going to have to see if I can auto-craft it. I'm going to have to build a bookshelf to put all these enchanted books on. But uh, my system's getting kind of full here on this armor. Just armor, 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 armor. Yeah, look at that. It's insane. Spoils bag. But yeah, so I got a little issue with that. But I also got another issue here over at the bee farm. Yeah, this is automatically taking... Now, I fixed most of my bee problem. I just got to remove all these extra bees I got. But uh, the system's going through and now processing very easily upstairs into all this stuff. As you can see, I have a level emitter. Pushing out combs. It's pushing through pretty good here for this other stuff. But uh, my biggest problem is I have a ton, and I do mean ton, of honey drops. So I think what I got to do is I got to barrel a few of those up. So that's our big task for today. As you can see, this is my uh, spider silk system. Just four of them building, you know. And I'm also getting experience off of it. If you look at that, my experience bar is slowly going up, but doesn't make much sense considering I'm level 84. So we gotta go build some barrels first. So let's go back to the main AE system. So I think I need uh, iron and wood for a barrel. So if we check uh, this system here. Uh, da -da -da. Where's the empty barrels? Empty booze barrel, that's not what I'm looking for. I gotta figure out how to do booze. Barrel, alright, so we need glass, iron ring, ooh, we need a blacksmith hammer, which that's easy enough, iron. So we need ink sack for that, okay. That's not bad, and we need some rings. Oh, one of those is gonna make 64, that's pretty good, and some just, you know, wood. Guess we have to use some oak planks, so okay, so. First things first. Let's grab some iron. Grab a stack of that. Do I have any sticks here? Might as well just grab one of those instead of, you know, breaking a whole bunch apart. And ink. Grab one of them. Get that going. Okay, and now oak. Should have plenty of oak going right now. That's a that's one I got going pretty bad here. So <clears throat> let's make a bunch of those. Let's make our hammer here. There we go, there's our blacksmith hammer, and uh, I guess we'll make two of those. Uh, I guess I can use that one more time here. Alright, oh, we need glass. Do I have any glass in the system here? Oh yeah, we got plenty of glass here. Like that, and said like this, like this. See how many this gives us. Boom. 32 there. Uh, let's grab another stack of oak. I guess I should go ahead and come over here and plan one of these here. Give me this. Uh, where's our pattern to come? There we are. So I guess the first thing we'll do is uh, we'll, we'll encode it to do this. Encode. All right, so as long as there's a hammer in the system, should be able to do that. All right, and then, we'll encode it to do this here. Because why have an ME system encode? 
if it can't encode these automatically, right? That's, that's the beauty about having all this. Let's go put this in the system here. So we'll go ahead and put these in the system, encoded, encoded. I gotta set it up so it knows how to make glass too. That's another thing, but that's all right. So this should be an easy one. So we click on that. Craftable. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Might as well just use whatever's left here in my system, in my inventory, right? Oh, first we need to get more planks. So this will give us 64, I guess. Not a bad start, right? Boom. All right, that's 64. Now, I believe one of these will hold 10,000 units. So we're looking at, what, 64,000 units of whatever we want to put in it. So let's come on down here. And uh, if I, let's click on this. And let's just put one in and see if it fills it. There it goes. Okay, so how many is in that? Yeah, 10. No, that's 100,000. 100,000 EU per ticket. I said, okay, so that's going to take a good bit. Now, what I want to do is I want to try automating, putting these in here and pulling them out. Look at that. Because that'll give at least some of this honey drops down. The reason I want to figure out how to automate this is I have this over here too which is monster essence way more than I'm ever going to need but I'm one of these pack wrap people that like to pack things up look at that it's already filling back up same thing with seed oil I got a ton of seed oil then if we come back here I have a ton of beeswax uh, being pulled from the bee system since you know, I got so many things going on here. So if I put this in here, it should get it pulled up into the ME system. So let me uh, let me see something about this. Let's see if I can automatic do this. Export fuzzy export bus. I guess I'm staying close enough to the bees that it's leveling me up as I stand here. And where's that one barrel? There it is. Give me that back. So I come over here. If I click right here. Export. Export this. Always active. If I turn that towards the system, is it pulling these out? I guess I'm going to need a precision import. Alright, let's see. Precision import bus. Put that one back. Yeah, I got a ton of stuff made already. It's ridiculous. Always active. Boom. Turn it now. Is it pulling those out? No. Hmm. I guess we can't automatically pull those out of here. Not a good sign here. Or is it just not connected right? Yeah, it's connected. That says import. I see. I. Yeah. Not gonna do it, huh? I'll just look that one up because it'd be really handy if I could just pull those out all together. All right, 
I need to click on this, click this, click this. Throw all those back into the system. Now, yeah, I'm still leveling up just standing here with these bees. I also got to do something with all these wisps. I need that Ara bee to get rid of them. I got a pig over there. Look at that stupid pig. There we go. Dumb pig. Got to do something with them, too. They're insane. Oh, I can't jump. Can't jump high enough. Can't jump. How are these guys coming? Do I have a stack of these ones? Not yet. Is my frame broken? Nope. Yeah, I know. It's a, kind of a sad way to do that, but... It makes it easy. And for some reason... These housing aren't being pulled in anymore. What the heck? Always active. Still not doing it. Move single item slash craft. All right, what's going on here? Plenty of string in the system. Only one stick. Is that the issue? It knows how to make sticks when it needs it. Be in. I mean, it's got plenty of wood. what's going on why this system won't keep going automatically I think I got to build a better computer system for it that's not crafting that's not crafting that's done so you should be able to do this I think I need to build a better CPU for this still not doing it Insert into the south. Insert southbound, so it should be doing it. Got both. Still going up. What's going on with this? I see now that I've ordered it to do it, it's going to build up. something now. Plenty of sticks. Give me one of these impregnated. It's not doing it. figure this one out and tell me, you know, it'd be great. Get wasting so much time trying to automatically do this. Untreated, always active, mover craft, 
Put that one in too. Moving them now. But I had to create them. Ugh, pain in the neck. Pain in the neck. Plenty of sticks in the system, so. All right, folks, so as the next thing I'm gonna do, I need a cotton farm built. That's my next two things. I need to do a cotton farm. I need to move these two things. As you can see, I'm uh, building in my uh, palace, my area. So the tanks there got a bit moved. So my next thing is to build enough barrels to automatically move my fuel and to start in here rebuild this internal area to build the rail system because I'm going to start building a rail system and then redo the power consumption with all the electricity we have I've been using a ton more red energy than anything redstone energy so I want to convert the whole plant of electric energy into redstone MJ energy into those and I think I'm gonna do that on the back side of this building over here this big old building over here back side of this is going to become not only is it the monster spawner but the back side is going to become probably the power center to do a red redstone energy cell system because I have all these solar panels sitting up here I think right now they're sitting at 100% and they're not being used. So I'm probably going to build a bunch of electric engines and push them down into redstone cells and then have that go into redstone energy conduit. So that's the next big plan for the next Monday night. Let me know what you guys think. I am Dark Xeno Knight and this has been a Minecraft Monday.